what's good youtube right now we're gonna sh i'm gonna show you guys how to clean your gucci slides these are my bs gucci slides the all scuffed up and dirty and black and wear them every day and damn they look like shit scratched obviously i can't fix the scratches so um we're just gonna do what we can to them right now they look beige and brown and disgusting and black and dirty and ugly and noodle head looking ass and nah they're just not gonna work with me so number one thing you're gonna need is um obviously a shoe cleaner you can use any shoe cleaner usually i use a uh, crep but I use a rejuvenator or a brush because it's better. It's an all-purpose brush. The crepe brush that comes with it is not that really, not really that good. I don't really recommend the brush. You're also gonna need a microfiber towel or a rag, or just any kind of towel or rag. But I recommend one like this. Next, you're gonna need some acetone or nail polish remover, and some cotton rounds and Q-tips, whichever whichever you have at your house. You're also gonna need some Krylon matte finisher. Make sure you shake it. All right, make sure you just put a couple drops. Right now I'm gonna show you how to clean it real good. Put a couple drops, put the lid on, get your butt, dip it in real good, get a good amount, healthy amount. And you're just gonna scrub gently where it's dirty. All right, I'll be right back with the next step. All right, now that I scrubbed it, I'm Going over the scuffs with acetone, make sure you don't get it on the paint. You'll take off all that paint and it'll look raunchy. All right, after I uh, went over a couple times with acetone over the small scuffs and I got all that rest of the dirt off, um, I went outside and I scraped it with the Krylon matte finisher. I didn't really record that because it's kind of dangerous and I had to do it outside. But what that does, it takes off all the little scuffs that you can't really see, but it's like, it, you can't really do anything about the big scuffs unless you want to paint over it and it's really hard to match those colors of gucci but i did what i could and this is the finished product right now i don't know i'm taking some bad angles to be honest um i'm after this video i'm going to post some pictures or another video of b-roll of how the sandals look now they look a lot lot better than what they were before um i highly recommend doing this process on any of your sandals they don't have to be gucci because you gotta look fly all right Peace.